Butterfly. He's going to focus on his butterfly drill as he's going through. He's going to do a 25, talk about what he did, focus on the actual swim in just a second. than my two arm backstroke. <laughs> backstroke faster than mine with one arm. This one, um, all right, this one is spin drill. You guys have never seen it before. What you want to do is like, you basically want to pop up. You want to spin your arms as fast as possible with not using your legs. It's going to look really weird, but it's kind of fun. <laughs> Breaststroke pull with a butterfly kick. It's probably one of my favorite breaststroke uh, drills, and it's the easiest one. <laughs> Freestyle. Um, two drills I like to do in freestyle. There's one is catch up drill. I'm sure everyone knows what catch up drill is. You just hesitate at each uh, front of your stroke. Also, there's a fingertip drag drill that I like to do. <laughs> So, 
even though they're like the easiest girls, they probably like taking the time to do them that way. <laughs> Oh, I mean they naturally do that. Yeah. <laughs> um, I picked that up from sprinters. Um, I know a lot of sprinters do that now, uh, just because it's it's quicker to get their arm moving over and pulling more water quicker. So, but I mean, distance swimmers are not going to be able to do that because. There's no way anyone, any swimmer can do a straight arm stroke for about more than like 100 meters. So that's what I picked up and I've, we've been practicing it. I've only been doing it only for finishes. So I mean, it's, that's where it really helps me out a lot is that last stroke that you take, that last breath. After I take that, it's probably about 12 meters out. I take that last stroke and then I start doing uh, my straight arm all the way into the finish. So you can see the difference. <laughs> so what you want to do is you can take your breath when you want to breathe and take your breath and relax is in the middle of the pool, not at the wall. That's probably one of the biggest things. And from fly to back, all it is is just putting your head down and driving, driving. You want to drive your knee into the wall. Well, not into it, but like drive your knee into your uh, into a tuck position as quick as possible. And that's going to allow you to rotate faster.